one senior in the group, Jared, he'll be a fifth year senior. Um, you know, he, he's the consummate senior leader, does the right thing. Had a, you know, last year, missed some games with some injuries, but um, still very, very productive. Just kind of has a feel for football in general. You know, um, you can tell him to do one thing, draw it up on a board, and then you go out there and you, you see it happen on the field and the offense does something different and he just naturally reacts and kind of does the thing that if you were watching the tape, you'd be like, oh, that's what, that, that's what I would tell you to do. You know, he does it on his own. Now he's almost like having a coach on the field, which is really, really good. And then, um, you know, after him, I've got Quinlan Dean, who will be a redshirt junior. So I've been in the program for four years. Same thing, you know, doing all the right things off the field and in the classroom. And then Stephen Harper, who will be a redshirt sophomore. So those are the guys that have taken meaningful snaps for me. You know, between Jared Quinlan, Mike Balsamo, and then you've got Stephen and Cam. You know, there, there's some guys that have been around. It's similar to a couple years ago where we had guys that have been in the program for a while but hadn't really played a lot of defense. This year there's kind of a, a good mix of guys that have been around haven't played a lot and then a, a, a mix of guys that have been around and played meaningful snaps. So, um, you know, it's a good, talented group. I'm looking forward to big things with them. And, you know, I think, um, you know, really only lose Jared, you know, after this season. So um, most of those guys will all be back. They've, they've got two or three years left. And, um, you know, I'm excited about the group. Productive last year and hoping to continue the trend this year.